Welcome. This is a accuracy rifle level, and the purpose of this level is a steady platform which will allow you to level your rifle um, with this ocular level, which will then allow you to align your reticle with um, a plumb line. Uh, using Earth's gravity, which is the reason why you need vertical elevation anyway. Um, this is the most precise way to, to, uh, to align your scope reticle. You can see the construction of this platform is very well made. It's very heavy. It's about uh, almost 16 inches by 16 inches. The, the adjustments are steel on steel, so they're very precise. Um, the feet on it are articulate for angle. Um, this vise here is uh, easy on your rifle and will take up to a four inch wide gun and it can be reversed for left handed operators. It has a quick release uh, and it also can be uh, torqued, although I don't think there's any reason to put torque on your, on your gun, but it can be. And uh, you can see it's a very, very well made uh, instrument. This uh, level here is ultra precise. It's actually for manufacturing equipment, uh, very, very uh, critical installations and that type of thing. The bubble width is um, 5 MOA per 5 or per 50 thousandths. So, um, So half the bubble width, half the bubble width is 5 OMA, MOA at a tilt of 50 thousandths. So that just shows you can get a, a rifle extremely level. And then once you have your rifle level, then you plumb your scope to gravity via a plumb line. You would not then put the level on a turret because the turret could be offset. Many uh, leopold, leopold uh, scopes have a turret offset of 3 degrees or so. Cytron 2 and several others. So you always want to align the reticle uh, to gravity. Then once you have that, then it's up to the shooter to, uh, to level the gun in the field. The nice thing about this, this uh, ocular level also is if you're a bench rest shooter, you can take this to the field and align your bench rest. So then you have uh, even more assurance you're not going to have any cant. Um, so Anyway, this is a little bit about the product, and now we're going to demonstrate an installation.